Namaste Pisces, welcome to my channel. This is Crystal, your High Priestess. Let's get into the readings for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please check out my second channel as well to see the other Pisces or um, Zodiac sign placements. So. We have two major arcanas that came out is the, um, the Hierophant and the Star. And then you have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio at the bottom. So this is the King of Cups. This is an apology or commitment, Pisces, or this is you renewing your faith. Okay, some of us could be praying more. Some of us could be going back to church. You can find a new faith. You might join a, a cult or some type of religious group. And then at the end of the readings, I will pull an oracle for Pisces. So let's see what else we have. Let me make sure you can see the cards. I knew it was going to come out. And then I seen the two of cups here. So you have Temperance, Reverse, Sagittarius Energy, Major Arcana, running out of patience. Or you might have a Sagittarius running out of patience. Oh. Let's see what this is. Seven of Wands. You're d defensive. Maybe someone is questioning your faith, all right? Someone is questioning your spirituality, and maybe you're not happy with that, Pisces. Let's see. Let's get two more messages. The full, wow. Four major arcanas so far. And the Ace of Wands, Passion, Love sexual chemistry here so you have aries taking a leap of faith and new beginnings starting anew all right some of us are ready to take the leap let's get two more actually let's get one more and then we will do future messages for pisces this is the past present energy for pisces see i see the knight of wands airs the osage let's see one more for pisces the queen of swords and i just was flipping through the, through the cards and i seen it just like knight the knight of wands again the bottom got the high priestess reversed. So the queen of swords, a crazy, but Gemini could speak of Pisces again, being firm, standing your ground about what you feel is right. Not taking no bullshit from anyone thinking, you know, more in your head about things, trying to figure out the ifs, why and what. Can we get three messages for Pisces, future messages? Here's a magician manifesting for 2024 for Pisces, messages for Pisces, 2024. Whoa. Eight someone still at the bottom. Nine of swords and the knight of pentacles it is reversed line of swords which is good so some of us are laying down these burdens and fear and worries can we get one more for pisces future advice emperance birthing a new idea 11 11 manifesting something pisces <laughs> I like it. Queen of Wands being adventurous. Two of Cups. Wow. Something you don't see coming. As always. All right. So Pisces, I do see Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. And your energy here is your future advice. Moving slow. 
I see an older woman or a mother type of figure, or this could be your energy, someone is looking up to you. All right. So some of us are planning some type of trip or taking a leap of faith towards a new religious group, or like I said, join a, an occult or a women's group or a men's group, something like that. You might just travel and have an a, awakening. All right. So let's clarify this reading for Pisces. I do see, which I can't ignore, there's two of cups, queen of wands, and the two of swords. So this could be a new friendship with a female friend or a new partnership with a, a partner. January 2024. You might not expect it because your heart is your heart chakra is blocked or your root chakra, which is your kudalini, which will be the root chakra while we have our menstrual. That is the kudalini area might be blocked. Let's see. Why is the star here? And when I say blocked, I mean like you're shutting it down if it's not for marriage. You're not interested. Before we clarify, break this down. We have Aquarius, Major Arcana, Taurus, Hierophant, Sagittarius, Reversed, Aries, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Libra, and the Taurus. Guess what's missing? The water energy, Pisces. Besides the two of cups that was there. Why is the star here? This healing for Pisces. Excessive expectations. Three Is that the three of cups? Yeah. So you're expecting something, Pisces, to be perfect. Nothing is perfect in life. So don't exceed your expectations because you will be disappointed. Why is the Hierophant here? Holding on tight to what? A marriage, commitment, Pisces, a promise, four coins, and a hierophant. Or you might have a Taurus holding on tight to you. Or a marriage, someone is holding on tight to you. Why is the temperance here reversed for Pisces? Yeah, release these ten of swords. Lifting anguish. Lift the swords out of your own back, Pisces. Okay, withstanding adversity. Don't allow these people to hold you down, to keep you down. You have a beautiful um, energy releasing some negative energy. Ten of swords reversed, nine of swords reversed. That's releasing the pain that has been inflicted upon you. This is why you are seven of wands, protecting your energy by all means necessary. If you got to use prayer. Okay, I see the strength, King of Wands as well. Aries, the Osage is reversed in the strength. Why is the Seven of Wands here for Pisces? Wow, Ace of Cups, you got love, emotional readiness. So you're trying to open up to love, but it's hard for you to trust because of past pain and anguish, Pisces. You're offering, you have an offer here. Let's see. The fool taking his leap. You're hesitant. This is why you have the queen of swords in your energy. You have seven of swords, hidden deceit. You don't trust. Well, that's the Aries energy. Don't trust you or you don't trust the Aries. You don't trust a new beginning. So this is why you need more time to think. You might tell them, like, I need more time. New excitement. Page of um, Cups, Pisces. Here's the water energy. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Offer of love, but you need to think. You need more time to think. Why is the Nine of Swords reversed? I see the Devil here reversed. Nine of Swords for Pisces. The Five of Wands. You don't feel like having a debate, revolving, re, re, um, 
resolving conflict. Five of Wands reverse. Yeah, you're trying to maybe someone said some bad words to you. You're trying to get over it, but you it's, it's stuck in your head. Let it go, Pisces. Nine uh, Knight of uh, Pentacles for Pisces. Why is Pisces moving slow? Or you have a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or a Libra moving slow towards you. Could be anyone. Knight of Swords, a crazy the Gemini now. Unstoppable force. So someone is moving slow or you're moving slow. But you're not going to give up. Recovering stability. So if you were destitute or felt like you didn't have enough money. Or financially scrap, you're going to get that money back. Why is the imprint here for Pisces? Last card for the future advice before we go into the extended. Feared change. So some of us could be fearing some change. Some of sometimes Pisces do, do get stuck in the routine of things. And uh, necessary endings and a haunting loss. Some of us are still stuck because of a lost past pain. So some of, the, some of us are afraid of change. Some of us are afraid to travel abroad, leave a different uh, um, a place where you feel safe or familiar to you. You're afraid to take the leap. But it's time to take that leap, Pisces. Have faith. Walk by faith, not by sight. All right? This is your faith card. So you have a yes as far as the reading for this reading, Pisces. <clears throat> Some of us might need to walk, for, walk away from a, a marriage or... A baby mother, baby father here. Or walk away from whatever burdens you feel is holding you down from taking a leap of faith. Okay. Let's see. Especially if you can work from home. I don't understand. Or if you travel. Take the travel. Accept the job for temporarily. Go to a different area. Let's see, what's the advice for Pisces Oracle messages for Pisces? Blessed. Too stressed to be blessed. And have faith. Faith. Blessed and faith. So this is exactly what I said. Take the leap of faith. Have faith, spirituality. Blessed, a blessing. Everything you can find is in your spirituality. Like I said, a group, a spiritual group, this is all speaking of religious or some type of religion. It can also be a relationship because we do have the um, two of cups. I do want to go into the extended and find out what the two of cups and the queen of wands means for Pisces and the two of swords reversed. So click on the link below. Namaste. Namaste, Pisces. This is your extended so you got the two of cups, all right? A soulmate type of energy, the queen of cups, Aries, the Osage, and the two of swords, something you can't see or don't see coming. Wow. And here's the two of cups. <laughs> okay, when I cut the deck. So that is a message, Pisces. Why is the two of swords reversed for Pisces? Eight of Wands, messages coming in here flying fast. The Her